A couple of days ago, I was talking to a friend of mine, and he reminded me of an issue we were having on the very first season of Soracraft. For some weird, unexplainable reason, chicken jockeys kept spawning inside of the underground. Every single cave was filled with them. And this would not be a problem if they did also despawn, which they didn't for some reason. And eventually it got to a point where the server just started crashing because there were too many entities in the world. Now I don't remember what caused the issue, but I do remember how we solved it. We disabled the chicken jockey from spawning altogether. So I'm going to show you how to disable a single individual mob from spawning in your Minecraft world with the power of plugins. Make sure to subscribe. So for this, we will be using WorldGuard. There's a big chance you already have it installed on your Minecraft server. If you have not, I will leave a link down below, as well as a link to WorldEdit, as it is a dependency to make WorldGuard actually work. Now, the reason we want WorldGuard is because it allows you to change flags in specific regions. But if you use the RG flags command outside of a region, you're actually able to change flags for the entire world. Now flags can do all sorts of things. For example, disable block breaking or block placement. It can also disable PvP, it can disable sleeping, and the list goes on. Now what you want to do here is navigate to the third page. That's all the way at the top, you will have the option mob spawning, but beneath that, deny spawn. Now this is the one we're gonna be using, because mob spawning will completely disable every single mob from spawning, but with the deny spawn flag, we can select an entity type. So when we click on the text entity type, it will automatically fill in a command for us. And over here, you just want to fill in the name of your mob. So for example, zombie, and then we press enter. And after that, behind deny spawn, it will say one time entity type. And when you hover over it, you can see that the zombie has been disabled. By the way, if you want to disable multiple mobs from spawning, you can just type both of the mob names with a comma in between. So zombie, comma skeleton when you type it like that without any spaces it will disable both mobs and if you want to remove disabled mobs again you can just click over here so it will fill the command again and then without typing anything you just want to press enter and by doing that it will clear the entire line again so when we now make it night and we go fly around for a little bit you will see creepers you will see skeleton you will see spiders but not a single zombie. Like you can see, the world is completely zombie free. Finally, you're able to disable these annoying phantoms you've been wanting to disable since day one. Anyways, that's gonna be it. Short video today, but hopefully I at least helped a couple of people out. If I did, don't forget to subscribe to my channel. You would help me out so much by doing that. And then uh, we'll see you in the next one. Bye-bye.